Hi, I'm Dr. Jane Miller from North Hudson IVF in Englewood Cliffs, New Jersey, and I'm here at ASRM, and one of the hot topics this year is implantation. Now we all know that to have a successful ongoing pregnancy we need three things. We need good young eggs, good sperm, and a hospitable uterine environment. A healthy place for those embryos to implant and take hold and grow. Up until now, all we've had has been ultrasound pictures to guide us as to when to implant or transfer the embryos. We also know the thickness of the lining of the uterus and the pattern of the lining are significant. But now we know that behind that picture, there are molecular events that will ha happen. And if those molecular events are not occurring correctly, we will not have implantation. There are two theories that are being worked on today, tests for both. One is, is the endometrium out of phase, meaning is the implantation window shifting in a particular patient, i.e. personalized transfer? Do we have a personalized system? The other is, is the endometrium really bad? Are there inflammatory proteins? Are there things that are bad that are making the endometrium resistant to implantation? Stay tuned. We'll know soon.